Uh, Badenoch, 58. Mordant, 82. Sunak, 115. Truss, 71. Tugendat, 31. So Tom Tugendat is eliminated from the election. The other candidates are able to go forward to a fourth ballot, which will take place tomorrow between 1 and 3 p.m., with the results announced at 4 p.m. Thank you very much. Well, there we are, the results of the third round of polling in the Conservative leadership race. And uh, very, very interesting indeed. Uh, Rishi Sunak uh, has increased his share of Conservative MPs from 101 to 115. Penny Mordaunt uh, stays in second place, but actually lost one vote. Uh, she's now on 82, having achieved 83 in the previous round. Liz Truss has gone up by 7, from 64 to 71. Kemi Badenoch uh, has gone up by 9, from 49 to 58. Tom Tugendhat lost another vote, uh, just above 30, which had been the hurdle to pass. Not anymore. If you finish bottom, you're out. And as you can see there, Tom Tugendhat uh, is ejected, as announced by Sir Graham there. And the next round, the fourth round of polling, it's pretty relentless this now until they get down to the last two, will take place between 1 and 3 tomorrow afternoon with the result announced at 4pm. So make a, a note of that uh, for the next stage of this fascinating race. Let's get reaction uh, again from our political editor, Beth Rigby. So, Beth, I mean, Rishi Sunak there continuing to to build just below the 120 that would have got him through automatically. But Penny Mordaunt dropped a vote. Yeah, look, Dermot, what, what's interesting about these results is the person who's showing the most momentum is actually Rishi Sunak. And given that it was Suella Braverman, who is on the right of the party, an arch-Brexiteer, uh, not necessarily the sort of backers uh, that would fall into the Rishi Sunak column, his team will be very pleased with that. Now he's just five votes off getting to the final two. Uh, T Tom Tugan had eliminated. Again, he lost a vote, uh, so he didn't put any on. He didn't lose loads, though, but he's eliminated. But as you said, uh, Dermot, Penny Mordaunt, you know, you didn't expect Penny Mordaunt really to pick up votes from Swella Braverman either. Uh, but for her to lose a vote here, that is not showing the momentum that her team would want. And she will be disappointed with that. She will be hoping to recover with some Tom Tugendhat hat votes coming her way. But then Liz Truss, too. I mean, Liz Truss... If this is a moment of momentum, she's put on seven votes. Kemi Badenoch did better than that. Uh, she's put on nine votes. So Kemi Badenoch actually doing better there than Liz Truss. So really now, you have Morden and Truss really slogging it out uh, for that second spot. Neither of them uh, will be particularly happy with that performance. Liz Truss slightly closing the gap on Penny Morden, but there's still uh, 11 votes uh, between them. And let's see what where the Tom Tugan hat votes go uh, in the next round, because as one of Morden's supporters said to me earlier today, they think that they will split between Rishi Sunak and Penny Morden. If that happens, uh, Rishi Sunak is pretty much now nailed on for the final two, and it's going to be an absolute vicious battle between uh, Mordaunt and Liz Truss uh, to get through. 